It's day two, and we are so grateful you are taking time to do this with us. That's right, we really are grateful. You know, we want prayer to be the best part of your day. That's right, prayer should be your first response, not the last resort. Many of you are fasting during this time as well. You know, Jesus said something really amazing about fasting in Mark 9. We are introduced to a father who brings his demon-tormented son to Jesus' disciples, only to be disappointed by the absence of the power they were proclaiming. Jesus shows up in the midst of this failure, not only with supernatural authority, but also with spiritual instruction. Mark tells us that after the boy was delivered, Jesus' disciples asked him, why couldn't we drive it out? He replied, this kind cannot be driven out by anything but prayer and fasting. During these 21 days, one of the best things that will happen is that you will become more and more aware of how much you need God. No matter who you are, you cannot do what God has called and created you to do without His help. We hope this quick word encourages you today and leads your prayer times. One way you can do more during this time is to share these videos and the other amazing content provided to lead and encourage you. Also, drop us a line in the comments letting us know what God is up to in your life. You got this. Be blessed and we will see you tomorrow for day three. For additional reading of the scriptures, you can find a link in the bio below or at citychurch.life.